So the added feature to the remote SL, which was announced at the NAM show 2007, was uh, a brand new feature to the AutoMap called AutoMap Universal. And that will affect the way you use the remote SL in plugin mode. So initially, when you install AutoMap Universal, you will get a box that looks like that. And all you do is look at all of the plugins that's on the left side and you drag them over to the right side. As soon as you do that, you have wrapped that plugin and it will now, now work as AutoMap Universal. Click OK. So now we are in Logic and we're going to insert one of those AutoMap Universal plugins. So you go into your regular uh, instrument insert. You would select an AU, inst AU instrument. And then uh, I have, now as you see, I have wrapped the Absinthe 4 and also the FM8. And you will see a duplicate of all of the plugins that you have wrapped. So you want to choose the one that says AutoMap next to it. When you open it up, you will see that the GUI looks pretty much the same. The only difference is that now you see a, these boxes on the bottom, and that is what the Novation AutoMap will add. Now you can learn the plugin initially and save it as a default so it will be controlled exactly in the way that you want and not the way that we have designed it to work. So for example, if you click on master here, all you have to do is click learn. This will learn once, move a fader. Now you move a fader and it's ready to control. Continue doing that with the next one move a fader, move the next one, it's learned. So now you have these two learned. You can, if you click on here, you can set it just in learn mode and now it just learn until you turn it off. You also have the option to save it as just a regular file in case maybe you want it to control differently for a specific setting, then you want to save it just as something particular, but you can also save it as default when you save it as default, it will be mapped out exactly that way in any application. So if you work on Logic and Ableton Live, for example, you do not have to map it out again. So that's the way that AutoMap Universal works in any application. Um, it will now work with AU plugins, RTAS, VST, any of the effects that you might have. 